G'day, I'm Seamus Bally, and today I'm here to talk to you about the Dartmouth Power Plant. You may have noticed the smokestack from the green on a chilly New Hampshire day. Initially in the process, trucks bring in number six fuel oil, which is stored in tanks behind the Dartmouth Power Plant. This fuel is then transported to the boilers, where it's burned and heats up water, which turns into steam. This steam turns the turbines which generate both electricity for campus and steam. The steam then travels through the steam tunnels under the green and heats up campus. This cooled down steam, aka water, then is transported back into the boilers and the process repeats itself. Here we are in the control room where the dirty business gets done. At Dartmouth, we burn number six fuel oil. This lovely looking fuel right here. We burn approximately 17,034,353 litres a year or 4.5 million gallons a year for all you Americans. Silly units. Follow me into the turbine room. Here we are in the turbine room. It's where we provide energy to campus. Judging by the racket, I'd say that's a lot of energy. Today I'm here to explore the steam tunnels. Remember lads, only authorised personnel, no students. Put on your hard hat and let's get into it boys. They run from here all the way to the Geisel School of Medicine. Well, made it. Just remember that as you're enjoying your warm, cosy room on one of those chilly New Hampshire days, where your fuel source comes from. Number six fuel. At Dartmouth, we emit 80,000 metric tons of CO2 per year, making us the largest polluter per student in the Ivy League. I don't know about you, but I'd like to change that. Cheers. <laughs>